This is a simple definition to show how to make a Doric column. First, we can change the height change the width of the pedestal, let's say 28, the thickness, change it to 7, and we can concentrate on this arc, change the radius of the base, change the height of the base, change this arc, we can, we can push it outside or inside. The center of that arc, the same. And once you do that, it's the same for the top the width of the pedestal, right here, the thickness, we can change the thickness too, and we can concentrate on this arc as well. Once we have all of these, we can concentrate on this part. We can see only, only the column, or preview, the flutes. There we have the flutes. How many? We can change that from here. Let's say 10 flutes. We can shrink the top and the bottom. This is the bottom. Notice. Let me go back to 4. And you can also scale the end. Now, the best part is this one. You can rotate the flutes. So we can go, let's say, up to almost 360. Right there. And we can change the thickness, the thickness of the flutes on the top. We can change that to point 2, for example. There. Now, we can scale the top, bring it more or less to the center, and right there we have two possibilities. We can add the flutes to the columns, like this, or we can subtract the flutes from the column. There. So one more time. Add the flutes. Subtract the flutes. I hope you can use and like this definition.